Why would you want to kill somebody who was just raised from the dead? Like because you're a better person than you were in the past Classmates pass gossip notes fast Hoping to rally up enough trash to suck you back into the ground So that they aren't offended by your progress Actions speak louder than loud poets Actions speak louder than loud pastors I will always be more impressed with one's lifestyle Instead of their style of vernacular tone and diction Which leads me to a story that I've heard tossed around before but never caught Lazarus was as sick as a starving cow with AIDS Dying brother of Mary and Martha His sisters upset at the Messiah for not saving them But everything happens for a reason And if you ever decide to make changes for the better You better brace yourself for bad weather Because better you means jealous me I said if you ever decide to cool the climate of your lifestyle You better hold on for hurricanes Because better you means jealous me Most of us know the story that he was risen But I didn't know chief priests tried to kill him After he was risen as if it was treason To change Yeah Drama <laughs> Straight out of the good book I can't take credit Quote But the chief priest plotted to put Lazarus to death also Because on account of him Many of the Jews went away and believed in Yeshua End quote In legal terms They wanted to destroy the evidence Imagine Being marked for death for dying four days ago from disease and sickness And from the lips of a Jewish African carpenter hammers words into the wind Powerful enough to rebuild life into the lifeless Lazarus, come forth I wasn't there But I picture like this many witnesses Silent Staring into the darkness of an open tomb for the most uncomfortable anticipation Lasting about 96 seconds or so before first hearing a shuffle 20 seconds later, first sight of his grave clothes Lazarus, inching towards a sea of spectators Mummified, shock, stronger than the stench of his rotted flesh And when word got back to some of the chief priests They wanted him dead again Because Laz, he never had to speak another day in his life His life echoed to the heavens that Jesus is real He is who he says he is Son of God, purple and pink sun rays Decorate white cloud canvases And split blue skies like the Red Sea in the last days a legion of trumpets sound as the return of the king shatters skepticism like glass As fine as salts of the earth we are for those who believe in Lazarus didn't have to say all of that All he had to do was walk John chapters 11 and 12 It's a really good story not perfect, we're being perfected, but well, we're not perfect. See, we have to get over this stuff because people don't we want we want to act like we want to act like we perfect and we never do anything wrong. We mess up sometimes. Some of y'all messed up before you got here. Somebody cut you off on the road, you gave them a signal, it wasn't a left turn signal. See, Lazarus drew honey and he drew enemies. There were some people who couldn't handle his change. At the same time that Jesus was raising him up, if you see the story, uh, the next verse says that the Jews, some of the Jews wanted to kill Lazarus. Poor Lazarus, he was dead. He was sick. Then he died, came back to life. Now they want to kill him again. He went through his situations. He went through his tribulation. He went through his problems. Now God changed him, and God made him a, a new man, and now there's people who cannot handle his change. I know there's people in your life that can't handle you changing, but that's not a reason not to change. God is not going to change. We have to change, and we have to raise our standard of living because people are watching us. If we continue to make the same mistakes year after year, treat people the same old way that we used to treat them. If there's not a marked change in our lives, people are not going to buy the fact that God is good. They're not going to purchase the fact that Jesus saves. They're not going to listen to all your talk. They're not going to listen to all your talk. Watching your lifestyle. Watching your lifestyle. Watching your lifestyle. Watching your lifestyle. Watching your lifestyle.